Hey what's up guys, today we will be doing an unboxing video. Today we're going to unbox the Nacon, Nacon Revolution Pro Controller from PS4. This one is officially licensed by PS4. Or by Sony, I mean. Looks pretty good, that's what the back of the box looks. This will be just an unboxing video. And then I will give my initial first impressions. Nice box, pretty decent, pretty decent. Let's cut this bad boy open. I don't want to mess with the box. It comes in a really nice case. So I don't really want to mess it up exactly. I'm gonna get my knife. Cut nice little slits in here. Looks like we got tape on the top and the bottom. just slides off like that looks like we got some more tape so we'll have to cut that as well all right and we got more tape on the bottom as well okay tape 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 it up oh shit Okay, you can see how the front looks. It's cool. It's like a little cobra symbol, which looks really sick. I don't know if you can see that really well on camera. It actually opens up. You can see there's like a little cutout of the controller. This piece just comes out. Oh, there's the controller itself. Oh my god. It feels really nice, really light. Which this, this controller does come with uh, some weights. Wow, this feels really nice. This is the one I was mostly looking forward to. Um, D-pad feels a little sticky initially, but it's probably because it's brand new. But the controller itself feels really good. I don't know if you can hear that. <coughs> but everything has a nice click to it and it feels really good quality. Really nice, so you can see that. Wow, that is nice. Look at that. That is freaking nice. The only thing I didn't like about this controller was that the the cable for it, the micro USB, has got this weird adapter piece, which I'm nervous if any of those pins break, how we might be screwed or might have to order another one, which would suck. If it's on the actual controller, it might be very costly. Uh, looks like we also got a instruction manual how to hook the cable in <laughs> Don't need to read that shit It also comes with this nice little carrying bag Here we go Nice little carrying bag to put it in and a nice cloth to wipe it down um, It does have a nice mate finish like a mat so it's not like glossy or anything, so it shouldn't get all greasy and get your fingers. Only this part at the top, so you, and you'll be able to wipe that off. And also comes with a nice little bag to put it in. Um, so if you're traveling and stuff like that, to just you know keep it somewhat new and scratch free and stuff like that. And you see, it just fits right in the bag. Pretty nice, actually. I like it. I like it a lot. Um, this is the controller I was most excited for. I will also be doing a box unboxing video for the Raju as well. And um, let's see what we got here. This should be just the USB cable. Oh, okay. So we got the added weights. I don't know if you can see that. Just added weights in here. Add some weight to it, which I might actually end up doing pretty because the controller itself feels pretty light. Um, I like to have a more heavy controller. That's just me personally, and there's all kinds of different size weights in there too, so I'll be able to see <coughs> what we're working on. Cable feels really nice, pretty long, got a lot of length to it, which is good. You don't got to sit right on it, and it's actually braided, um, so I'm actually looking forward to that. So the only part I'm nervous about is this end piece right here nervous about that breaking or something like that so that that's just one thing to uh, be careful about um 
one thing you'll want to do when you attach this is to make sure that the holes line up first and it plugs in and then tighten the uh, tighten the brass screw or steel screw around it get it nice and tight not too tight as you see that's what the controller looks like really nice really happy with this controller um, I will do a first impressions video I mean like a review an actual review I definitely like this way this feels if you're a big fan of the Xbox controller design you'll definitely like this one uh, definitely a lot it feels really freaking good really good I love the clicking that's that seems like it's gonna be really good there's also two other extra buttons down here and this is actually four different buttons so you really customize these you got one right here one right in the center and one right here so for certain games I could feel how that it's usually your your ring finger and your pinky aren't really doing much sorry your middle finger and your index finger can actually hit those buttons really easy while you're doing you know all your combos and stuff mostly got this for fighting games but it looks really nice I'm really excited to start using this thing and see how bad it is so let's get this out of the way all right so that's my unboxing video for the uh, Nikon Pro controller looks really nice I'll have the uh, this this controller is gonna run you about a hundred bucks on uh, Amazon a uh, really nice controller um, Pretty cool features and stuff like that. You got two different control modes, and you also got profiles. And you can pull this in the computer and install the software and completely map all the buttons. That's the whole benefit of it. Um, also down here, you use the little key to get this to open to add weights to it to make the control a little bit heavy. I don't know if I'm gonna do that right now. I don't want to bore you guys with that. But um, the weights come in here, and they also come with a little key, and you can just open it and put the weights in. For me, I got it. It's gonna take me a while to find what kind of weight I like because it does come with different styles and different, you know, different weight itself. <coughs> Excuse me. So, um, overall, uh, good first impressions. Um, controller itself feels really good. Everything feels really responsive. It doesn't feel cheap. Uh, it doesn't feel like it's gonna break easy. Uh, really satisfied with this controller. This is the one I was most excited for. Uh, we'll be unboxing the Razer Raju as well. So I hope you guys enjoy that. And I hope you guys enjoy the video. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe. And I'll get back with you. And this is Cobra signing out.